All right, Shalom. I want to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakar Kodash. Double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone who grew well and peace and blessings of the Akiam that's out there laboring and doing this work in truth and sincerity. And uh, what you see here on the screen was uh, the commanding General Yohanna, okay, make a statement. We don't hate white people, but God hates white people. And this statement was made back in 2013 as um, they were in court fighting over um, the First Amendment, okay, freedom of speech. Um, and he basically uh, uh, had won a settlement, so to speak. And um, he had made this statement. So I guess according to um, ISUBK standards, uh, General Yohanna has the mark of the beast. You know, you see how simple they are, you know, because um, this, is a, this is a response to um, Apostle Tahar's video that he had just put out um, with uh, Yohanna spewing his madness on his uh, radio station. And he had made the statement concerning uh, the Jake that got blown away by the, uh, the Edomite cop woman uh, where the, um, the, the Jake's brother, OK, all right, the victim hugged the uh, murderer, okay, the Edomite woman, and also the judge. So he basically said that that's the mark of the beast. You see? Okay? So, uh, I guess you joining hand in hand, that's supposed to uh, 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 say that that's the mark of the beast, more or less. You know? But um, real quick, I want to go back uh, two years prior to this particular video, okay? And we're going to go to where the That's right. Cause your heart, your, uh... Before I start this video Okay um, This was uh, um, The apostles on um, 34th and 7th And um, they ran into um, The minions from um, ISUBK And uh, you know It became a, a, a shout match But um, there was Questions that were posed Even back then and This video is from 2011 Okay all right so, you know, these guys, man, you know, hey, it's been uh, well over almost uh, 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 10 years, man. Well over 10 years, man, how we've been uh, saying that the mark of the beast is the RFID microchip, man. You know, and um, I want you to listen carefully, okay, to um, the words that are being exchanged. And I'm only going to play uh, a little bit of this clip, but uh, let's, let's play it. Somebody had called and asked him, right. asked him, how much did he take to sell out? Right. All right? Because uh -huh. the guy was explaining so that the market is these, the market, well, how's it well, bullshit? You so how's it in the same in the same Hebrew? No, 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 he told them that yeah, you have the mark of the beast. You hate white people. You see, <laughs> you love white people. You know, I mean, he they they really would really these people these people are reprobates, man. They really think okay, all right. They are really teaching that that's the mark of the beast, man. Okay, this video is from 2011, man. Okay, you see, because um, the apostle was a uh, 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 questioning them. About what the mark of the beast is Okay And they did not give No kind of answer That was the only answer that they gave I'm just going to play a little bit more Alright You know this, man. Do that. All over the scriptures. He messed up. He didn't know he did that. He messed up. You want to lose your life? He messed up. You better stop dealing with him. He messed up. Y'all know better than that. Y'all know better than that. You don't need to talk to that guy. Man, he don't be dealing with no crackers, man. He don't know nothing. Don't be dealing with no crackers. We know these guys sold out. We know. So basically, you know, they're saying that you join your hand in hand with the Edomite is um, basically the mark of the beast, man. You know, 
You see? Okay? So, um, let me just hit the scriptures real quick. You know? Because, like I said, these guys, they really think, okay, to this day, man, they, they're really pushing that. You know? Okay? This is Titus chapter 1, verse 15. Unto the pure, all things are pure. But unto them that are defiled and unbelieving, nothing is pure. You know? And they can't get it, man. You know? And any of the followers, you know, okay? Listen, just take the chip, man. Okay? You see? Because you, you people are unbelieving. So you're slated to take the chip, man. Okay? There's no stopping. There's nothing that's uh, 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 going to stop you from taking it, man. Okay? Because you don't believe in what the scripture says. You see? Right? The unbelieving, nothing is pure, man. These words are not pure. The words are not plain to you, man. You see? Right? But even their mind and conscience is defiled, man. You know? And anybody following them is gone because I want to address a comment that's on um, Apostle Tahar's video. Okay? All right? About these people that actually follow Yohanna, man. You see? All right, right. They profess that they know the Most High, but in works they deny Him. You know, because they're not being a, a, a fruitful man. Okay, their works are, are dead works, man. You see, because the main prophecy that's down a pipeline, man, and they can't see it, man, and they're teaching their congregation uh, uh, otherwise, man. You see, and in in there leaves room, okay, to safely say that these people sold out, man. You see? Okay? You're playing right into Esau's hands because Esau uh, likes to paint that gray area, man. Okay? So now when something that's a major prophecy that's about to come out, you know, all right, that we foresee, you see, here it is. You got guys like Sabak and, 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 and Yohanna and IUIC, you know, here it is. They paint a gray area, man, you know, to where the people that are unlearned, okay, uh, can't decipher, man. Whether, whether it's the mark of the beast or if the chip is the mark of the beast or not, man. That great area, that area of doubt, man. Okay? You know? That plays into Esau Edom's hand, man. You see? Right? They profess that they know the most high, but in, but in works they deny him. Being abominable and disobedient, you know? And, and they're basically disobedient, man. Because first of all, man, these guys don't know nothing, man. You know? And they're not getting under the order, man. You see? They thinking somebody, people uh, are supposed to come under them, man. You know? You know, in the video they have these these men are, are trained professionals, man. <laughs> you know? <laughs> trained professional uh, uh, demons, man. Okay? You see? Right? But being abominable and disobedient and in every good work, reprobate, man. So these, these, these guys are a bunch of reprobates, man. And anybody else that basically follows them, man. You know? Okay? Um... Real quick, I want to get back to uh, another clip I want to play. Well, not even a clip. I want to get into... Uh, I want to get into a comment, okay, that is actually on this page. Um, let's see. All right. Let me flip it up real quick because I want to get to the point. Okay. All right. This is... Where is this comment at? Okay. All right. Comment by uh, Funky Chicken, okay? It says, Apostle, you have taught mad and insane doctrine. One of them being, you kick your B to the curb and kids, and I can bring out a few more of them. Oh, and of course, your year 2000 prophecy, you know? So also, you know, this this is just shows you that this is a... a a fallout boy right here, more more than likely, man. You know? But I want to address this comment. You know what I'm saying? But as you see, when you go to their page, no no con no no content. Okay? You see? They like to hide behind these uh 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 faults uh, uh avatars, you know? Alright. So addressing okay, his comment, you know, let's get let's get the scriptures, you know. Let's get it. First scripture I want to get is, uh, let's get First John chapter two, verse eighteen. Little children, 
it is the last time. And as you have heard, the Antichrist shall come. Even now, there are many Antichrists, whereby we know it is the last time, you know. And, you know, here it is. You got this scarfer that's coming on the comic board, man. And talking about nothing concerning the subject, man. Okay? All right? The subject matter was the mark of the beast, man. Okay? But here it is, you know. And this is one of them guys that probably fell out around the, uh, the year 2000, man. You know? Where you had them uh, 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 formed by the wayside, man. You know? You see? But these guys are, are, are obviously uh, uh, against this truth, man. You know? You see? Right? Verse 19. They went out from us, but they were not of us, man. You know? And the Lord's going to uh, 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 sift, man, who was, is not of us, man. Okay? Who is not supposed to be part of this church. Okay? Who's not supposed to be part of this body, man. Okay? The Lord's going to get rid of these people, man. You see? And um, he was one of them, man. Okay? And guys like him. That are standing on a sideline, okay, with no works and and, and, and unbelieving and, and, and scoffing, man. You see? Right? For if they had been of us, they would they would no doubt have continued with us, you know? And if they was part of the um hopeful elect, they would still be laboring in this thing, man. You see? Right? But they went out that they might be made manifest that they are not all of us. You see? Okay? Because it's made manifest that they're not of us, man. Because they, they uh, fell off, man. You see? Right? Verse 20. But ye have an unction from the Holy One, and ye know all things. You know? And the Lord said that he gives he, he uh, gives his secrets to his servants, the prophets, man. Okay? And only the prophets can see, all right, the mark of the beast being the chip, man. Okay? These other guys can't see that, man. You know? They're still going to come in with that same old, old, old doctrine, okay, of, uh, of uh, 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 loving white women is the mark of the beast, man. You see? They're still talking about that, man. You know? But we just found out that for him to be a hypocrite, man. You see? Because we can get back, okay, to that video. Let's get the video real quick, okay? If I'm making that statement. Ops at Liberty Place in ISUP schools webs. In addition, they say the group and that's not protected by the First Amendment. We don't hate white people, but God hates white people. Commander General Johannes. Yeah, I just want to get the video and uh, the audio on that, yo. You know, because uh, 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 he's a hypocrite, man. You see, you know, and th that's sloppy, man. You see, you know. Okay, right. Next scripture I want to get. Let's get the. Uh, Matthew chapter 24 verse 45 and it says who then is that faithful and wise servant whom his Lord had made ruler over his household to give him meat in due season you know so who is that faithful and wise servant man you see okay right right blessed is that servant whom his Lord when he cometh shall find him doing so man you know what doing this work man you know because yahana he does he hasn't shown his face out out on the um, highways and hedges man you know you see that you know verily i say unto you that he shall make him ruler of all over all his goods you know and that's being our uh, joint heirs of the kingdom man you see right but and if that evil servant shall say in his heart my Lord delay of his coming, you know, like that scoffer that was on the page, you know, because you got guys that, that get restless in this thing, man, you know, and uh, they start uh, unbelieving, you see, and they say in their heart, no, the Lord delay of, man, you know, you see that, because he's scoffing at the year 2000 um, 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 prophecy, that's what they want to call it, you know, right, and shall begin to smite his fellow servants and to eat and drink with the drunken, you know? And this man is eating and drinking with the drunken man because he's of the world, man. He's taking on whatever other philosophies that is out there aside from the truth, man, you know? And him smiting the fellow serpents is you uh, 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 coming up against them, man, okay? Come up on a comic board, scoffing, coming up to the camps, scoffing, you see, okay? And, uh, you know, 
if you had it your way, man, you you would you would actually physically want to put him to death, man. You see, okay, or, or hand him over to the um uh, um to the authorities, man. You see, right? Verse fifty, the Lord the Lord said said of that servant shall come in a day when he looketh not for him, and in an hour that he is not aware of, and that that scoffer, okay, the Lord's going to take catch him with his pants down, man. Okay, because he's one of them guys that that turned uh uh he took his uh, hand off the plow, you know, you see that, okay, but now he's just a a, a a scoffer, you see that, right? But the Lord's gonna come in the day where he's not aware of, right? Next verse, and shall cut him asunder, and appoint him his portion with the hypocrites, right? Because he's a hypocrite, man. Right alongside um. He's defending uh, Yohanna in some type of way, okay? Because you want to wait to this uh, point in time to come up on a comment board and scoff, you see, okay? When the when the subject matter was not even anything what you're talking about, man, okay? It's talking about the chip, okay? So what do you think about that? Obviously, you don't believe that the chip is the mark of the beast, man, okay? Right? But you you will be appointed your portion with the hypocrites, just like Yohanna, man, okay? Because you heard it out of his own mouth, okay? All right. Basically, essentially, what he's saying is that uh, he said it. I didn't say it. Talking about the Most High, okay? Right? Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. That's what he's referring to. You see? Okay. Right? There shall be weep weeping and gnashing of teeth, man. You know? And that time's gonna come, man, for you, you scoffers, man. You know? And all you, 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 uh, uh, uh non-believers, man. You see? Okay, right? Let me get real quick. Let me get our uh, Hebrews. Eleven and six. And it reads, but without faith. It is impossible to please him for he that cometh to the most high must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him, man. So without faith, it's impossible to please you. How about Shem Yahushai, man? You know, you see, and we see that these people lack faith, man. OK, the scoffer lack, lack faith. OK, that has a nerve to, to, to speak at a turn, man, you know, and not keeping his foot. You see. OK. This matter is not even concerning anything that you have anything to say about, man. Okay? You see? You know? Right? Uh, what I want to get was, uh, let me see, real quick. Go off the cuff real quick. No, no, no. Let me finish addressing what he had needed to say, man. We're going to say in Matthew chapter 19, right? And uh, uh, 27, man. You know what I'm saying? Right? And what did, what did uh, Yahweh Shah tell Peter, man? Right? Then Peter answered and said unto him, Behold, we have forsaken all and followed thee. And what shall we have therefore? You know? And, you know, these men that were following uh, uh, Yahweh Shah, they've forsaken everything that they uh, had, man. You know? Right? Verse 28. And Yahweh Shah said unto them, Verily I say unto you, that ye which have followed me in the regeneration when the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory, ye also shall sit upon the twelve thrones, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. You see that? Okay? So he was talking to the, his disciples, man. You know? Right? Verse 29. And every one that have forsaken houses, or brethren, or sisters, or father, or mother, or wife, or children, or lands, for my name's sake, shall receive an hundredfold and shall inherit everlasting life okay so he made a comment about uh yeah you said uh uh uh, uh kick your kids to the curb and, and leave your wife and, and and listen you you are put your walk is your walk alone man you see okay and and anybody that you're dealing with they have to get with it man you know but my thing is that if they are hindering your your your, your uh um your walk okay and, and following your how about Shem Yahweh Shai, you see, okay, if they're, if they're hindering your walk, man, they, hey, man, you got to forsake them, man, 
You see? Okay? But my thing is that, hey, if she, if you, if she be uh, dwell, or pleased to dwell with you, okay, then, 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 you know, you, uh, uh, you, you deal with her, man, you know? Okay? Because you got a lot of brothers that, that basically have, have women that are basically unbelievers, man. You see? Okay? But your walk is your walk alone, man. And you just have to make sure that nothing uh, uh, hinders, man, hinders your walk, man. Okay? In this faith, man. You see? All right? But the, but Yahweh Shai told Peter, okay, basically what he shall have to come, man, by forsaking which, what he have forsaken of this world, man. You see? Okay? So that's a cut on you right there, man. You see? All right? And then he was talking about the, the, the year 2000 prophecy, man. You know? We got to get Matthew chapter 13, uh, verse 17. You know, for verily I say unto you that many prophets and righteous men have desired to see those things which ye, ye see and have not seen them and to hear those things which you hear and I have not heard them. You see, OK, and really a hey, de hey, desiring to see the Lord, man, you see, you know, but uh, uh, um, it was another precept I wanted to grab, um, but it was the, the um, just a uh, precept of, of, of men desiring to see the day of the Lord, man. You know, okay, but I want to get into this this um, parable of the sower, man, because this is what this guy falls into, right? Right? Hear ye therefore the parable of the sower. And when anyone heareth the word of the kingdom and understand it not, then cometh the wicked one and catcheth away that which was sown in his heart. And this is he that received the seed by the wayside. But he that receiveth the seed into stony places. The same is he that heareth the word, and Ammon with joy receiveth it. But yet he have no root in himself. Right? And you got all these scoffers that are out here that are scoffing against Great Millstone. You know, you basically wasn't attached to this root to begin with, man. You know, these guys come up under um, IUIC, um, ISUPK, GOCC, you know, okay? Them guys are not going to give you any root, man. Okay? Because they don't have the truth. You see? Okay, but they come up against that root, man. Okay, you see, right? But yet he have not root in himself, but endure for a while. For when tribulation or persecution ariseth because of the word, by and by he is offended. You know, you see, you know, you got guys that fall into this category, man. You know, with these scoffers, man. You see, you know, all right? They they catch a hell and they, they they don't know how to handle it, man. You see, right? Verse 22, he also that receiveth seed among the thorns is he that heareth the word and the care of this world and the deceitfulness of riches choke the word and he become unfruitful. You see that? Okay. So this word actually chokes, chokes these people, man. Okay. All right. To where they become unfruitful, man. Okay. And, and you're basically good for nothing, man. You see, you know, right. But he that receiveth seed unto the good ground is he that heareth the word and understandeth it, and also bear fruit and bringeth forth some of hundredfold, some sixty, some thirty. You know, okay, and and, and that's these men that are basically uh uh, uh you know uh, flourishing in this truth, man. You know, which is great millstone, man. You know, okay, we're basically the the the, the final line of, of, of the fence, man. Of the gospel, man, is is who you see out there, man. You see nobody else. You know, you see that. But um, hey, man, we just found found this man to be a uh, a hypocrite, man. You see, okay. But um, that's it. You know, I just want to uh, address uh, General Hanna uh, uh, being caught up in his own words, um, with contrary to what his uh his menu was singing, you know. You know, talking about, oh, oh, you love white women, you know, but we seen General Hanna, what he said, okay, all right, but he's saying that that's the mark of the beast, you know, and then they're addressing that scarfer, man, of, of these, the blind leading the blind, they shall both fall into the ditch, man, you see, all right, so with that, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakah Kodash, double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who rule well, and peace and blessings to the Akim that's out there laboring, and doing this work in truth and sincerity. Shalom.